ShotLink is the uh, scoring and statistics system uh, that was developed by the PGA Tour about 10 years ago so we can do uh, real-time uh, live scoring during the actual uh, golf tournament. It's entirely staffed by volunteers. We have uh, an army of, uh, some cases, a couple hundred volunteers that helps us as both uh, walking scorers and laser operators. So we have a walking score that goes out with every group, which has a, a handheld computer. Uh, they actually go through and they punch in, they record the scores, uh, they record the strokes, they record the lie of the golf ball uh, as it actually happens. That's how the scores all get generated and we can build our leaderboards from that. Uh, we also have uh, two lasers on every hole staffed by a, a team of volunteers and the lasers actually will shoot the golf ball once the players have hit it. Uh, it stops and comes to rest. Uh, they shoot the golf ball so we can measure all of our distances uh, so we can see exactly how far uh, let's say Ernie L's last drive was. Uh, when somebody gets up on the green, we can tell that uh, Phil Mickelson's next putt is going to be uh, 12 feet 6 inches. Uh, that's all recorded from our uh, laser data. Uh, as far as the, the volunteers themselves, we have a lot of retention. A lot of people that come back year after year after year. They love you know, seeing golf, they love being around the, uh, the players. Uh, you know, the laser volunteers and the walking scorers are inside the ropes, so you can't get a better seat than that, you know, walking with, you know, uh, you know these groups for, you know, 18 holes or, you know, being you know, 10 feet away from some of the uh, the guys. Uh, the ones that work up in the Greenside Towers are up in a little tower that's about, you know, uh, 10 feet up in the air. So they have a fantastic bird's eye view of the entire green. They can see everything that's that's going on. It's really nice. You get to see the whole green. Uh, yeah, it's, it's this is a great hole. Pe people have been doing this for many years. They know the holes. They know them very well. And so, uh, you know, they don't even have to look at the clipboards half the time to mark where the ball landed. You know, the hard part is aiming the laser, but then you've got to remember to get your palm pilot out and select the right golfer, and it just becomes one of those, okay, am I shooting this? Have I got the right guy set? My score reflects the leaderboard, so you don't want, you know, you don't want to be inaccurate. Oh, staying attentive and, and paying attention, you know, you can be distracted. Oh, I don't enter anything until I go to that specific player each shot I try to stay kind of in line with them to know that I'm on this player um, and then I don't proceed until you know the next player but I don't uh, anticipate shots uh, don't anticipate putting data in that's where you make mistakes I uh, hear it in our control room is where our producers are going to be sitting and they actually watch the data coming in uh, as it comes in live uh, they can take a look at it. We have our computer set up here so they can manage it. If anything looks out of the ordinary, uh, they can call out and say, hey, did, you know, so-and-so actually get a hole-in-one. So when there's things like that, they're big like an eagle. Let's just verify it real quick before it actually goes out to uh, the TV and the rest of the world. A lot of the players use it to uh, look at some of their stats and see you know, what was their you know, driving distance, uh, what was their average you know, this year. Uh, they can see uh, you know, stroke trails and such, uh, ball charts for not only how they played, but how other players have played uh, uh, a certain hole. Well, I've never worked shot line before. Quite a few golfers from Windyke that I play with are out here, and they encouraged me to come out. They said it was fun.